Hello everyone, welcome to Fawen Channel. I am Fawen, and this is my channel. Today we're gonna play FTL, but in a special segment I like to call Will Fawen Survive? Now, the premise is pretty simple. Um, it's like Iron Man mode and a bunch of other games where you play until you die. There's no reloading saves or anything like that at all. Uh, for this specific segment, Will Fawen Survive? It's like that in that I will not reload saves, I'll play until I die, I am not allowed to hire more crew members or team members. Now if I run into a mission where we end up picking up a guy or rescuing a guy or just getting one through a mission, that's fine. And they are part of the crew, they are part of the Will Follow and Survive. Um, it doesn't end when the original crew dies, they're part of the crew now. But no extra people, go until you die, no reload saves. All right, now let's get started. Now, if you're not familiar with FTL, pretty much the premise is simple too. You have a spaceship, you have a crew, you go on space adventure without getting killed. So let's first rename our ship to the wonderful Arthurian legendary sword, the Excalibri. Yes, the Excalibur. All right. Um, oh, and we're going to rename the captain to Fallen. And our first mate is going to be female, and it's going to be the great Dr. Micro. And the first crewman is going to be my brother, Kale. I think this is how he spells it. I know he doesn't spell it like the plant, but it sounds like the plant. All right. We're going to do it on normal, which is also... I probably should do it on easy, because easy is just as hard as any other games like normal or hard. But we'll just do it on normal, see how far we get. All right. Let's get started. All right. Warp Factor 1, let's go! The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll need supplies for the journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before the pursuing rebel fleet can catch up. And then there's a tip here when you see a blue blah 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 blah. Alright, so, we're being chased by the rebel fleet, and we're just trying to make it to the Federation fleet. Alright, so let's see, we got... Dr. Micro on the engines, we got Kale on weapons, and we got me, and I am piloting the Excalibre. All right. So let's turn on our weapons, that way once we get in a fight, they can just load. Um, we got 10 scrap, which we can use to buy upgrades. Uh, we got one bubble of shields. The more bubbles we have, the better shields we have. Our hole is basically our health. Uh, how much fuel we have. Each fuel point equals one jump to like another area. We got eight missiles and two drone parts. I don't know if we're going to really need those. Um, now having different crew members on different areas will increase your ability to evade or do this, that, or any other. Uh, my crew members are not skilled at all in anything, but that'll go up as we get into missions and stuff. Um, and that's pretty much... Oh, this green bar is the individual crew member's health. And if they get hurt, I can just send them to the med bay. And that's pretty much it. Uh, they got the pilot over here. Security here lets you see all the different squares where you don't have a person in there. Door control is so that you can close and open doors in case someone boards you, or if you want to vent people, or even fire out the window. Uh, shields keeps the shields up. If that gets damaged, you gotta send somebody over there to repair it. Weapons is for weapons, that's obvious. Engines is for engines, that's obvious. And O2 is your oxygen. Now, as you can see right here, the oxygen went down when it opened up the uh, space doors outside. So you need to make sure oxygen is up so that um, your guys don't drown in space or get spaced or whatever they call it in space. They don't run out of air and suffocate, all right? Okay, so let's get started. Let's jump to our very first section or point. Uh, oh, oh, okay, so the little green 
dots indicates where I can go, and the yellow one's where I can go after I get there. That's cool. Um, let's just jump here. Let's see where, where we go. Engage! Oh, oh, pirate scout. Scans show a remote sediment being blockaded by a pirate ship. The ship hastily messes you. Stay out of this or you'll be next. Concentrate fire on. Okay, so we can either attack the pirate, in which we'll get loot from destroying the pirate ship. Um, and the people that we just saved might give us stuff too. Or we can ignore them and move on. Uh, you know what? Let's go after him. Oh, wait, he has a transporter too. That's what this little symbol means, which means he can put marines over on us. I don't think we have the people to really deal with that. So, you know what? Sorry, guys, we're out of here. It's just not possible to see to save every citizen affected by this war. Prepare your jump. Sorry, Charlie. We're out. Um, alright. Let's, uh... Well, we're gonna have to go here eventually. Well, you know what? Let's go here, and then we can jump back if we want to. <clears throat> oh! Oh! This beacon is being patrolled by an unmanned scout. A fight is unavoidable! So we're fighting an auto scout. Alright. Red alert, everyone! The ship starts to power up its FTL. Oh, we gotta stop him from running. Power up the weapons! Go for the engines! Do we really have to wait for this to power up every time we fight? Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Ha ha ha! Oh, shoot, that's not what we wanted. Um, fix it, fix it, fix it, fix it! Oh, shoot, there's a fire. Uh, let's get rid of that fire. Get out, get him, get him! There we go, he ain't going anywhere in time. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh oh, Dr. Micro needs some help. Uh oh. Stop shooting holes into my ships! Okay, Micro, get out of there and go up here. Ship breaks apart, and you feel relief in the knowledge that you will hopefully still be one step ahead of the fleet. Whew! We got two missiles, one part, and some seven salvage. Oh man, that was that was cool. Whew. All right, continue on. Let's uh, let's fix our ship and our crew. Oh no! Oh no! It's not good. Get in there and take out that that fire. That can close. Um. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, no, that's not good. It's not good at all. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna open up some stuff. Oh, no, I can just open these guys up. Whew. What are you doing, Captain Fox? He's just standing there. Oh man, we all, our oxygen's not too good. Get in there and help with the oxygen tanks. Oh, <laughs> we vented all the oxygen that we need to. Okay. Everyone chill in here until we get enough oxygen. <laughs> oh my god. Our first encounter almost killed us right off the bat. Look at that. Okay. <sighs> and our engines are down. Oh, this is not good. Oxygen. Okay. Wow. See what I mean by, like, normal is also pretty freaking hard? And that was, like, a little scout guy. Like, he was nothing. <laughs> we almost bit it. Oh, we almost bit the big one. Get in there and fix stuff. Oh. Can't even jump anywhere right now. Okay. <sighs> That's ridiculous. Back to the weapons with you. Well, we got some salvage. Maybe we can actually do something with our ship. Can we upgrade? We can upgrade the engines, but we don't have enough power to do anything. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll keep what we got. Okay. All right. Whew. We're gonna wait for the oxygen to return to 100%, and then we're gonna jump next time on Fawin Channel. If you like what you see, uh, hit like, leave a comment if you want, or even subscribe for more content. See you guys next time in the verse. Take care.